Hello and good morning. Uh, for those who do not know me, my name is Tristan Schubert and I am your summer seminarian here at Holy Trinity for June and July. Uh, Father Dave asked me to do these reflections on Tuesdays and so here goes the first one. Uh, for my first reflection, I decided to do it on what I feel is perhaps the most important part of our faith, the Eucharist. The Catechism calls the Eucharist the source and summit of the Christian life, and I think that is a very valuable expression. The, the Eucharist is the source of our faith. Jesus, Jesus Christ, at the time of the Last Supper, gave us himself to be truly present with him, to be truly present with us for then until the end of time. And if, if he hadn't done this, if he hadn't carried his cross of cavalry, suffered his crucifixion and death, if he hadn't risen, risen again on the third day, then Christianity simply wouldn't exist. And the Eucharist is the making present of that sacrifice once more. It is us remembering and celebrating and experiencing that time of the Last Supper, that time of Jesus' greatest sacrifice once again. It is, it is truly the culmination of our faith. And it is both the origin as well as what our faith is drawn towards. It is, it is the summit of our faith, the, the highest praise that we can offer to God. I've, I've heard it explained like this, in that God in his loving divinity gave his son Jesus Christ to us. We in turn want to give, give something back to God, some, some sort of thanks and sacrifice for for to him to him and we're only human we don't have something necessarily worthy of divinity to give to him throughout the time of the old testament the jews offered countless animal sacrifices to god and while that was appropriate for that time it needed to be offered over and over and over again because it it simply wasn't enough for God and his divinity. But now God has given us his son, given us Jesus Christ in his fullest divinity. And so we choose to, as, as a gift to God, offer him up once again. Now, I do get that this kind of sounds like we're simply re-gifting Jesus, uh, but it's, it's actually the most fitting praise that we can give to God the Father, a divine sacrifice of his Son offered once and for all on Calvary, not needing to be offered over and over again, but simply being made present once more. And for this and many other reasons is why it's so exciting for Mass to be open once again. And now we have this opportunity once again to gather together and receive nourishment, receive that source of our faith, as well as offer up our praise and sacrifice to God in the most holy sacrifice of the Eucharist. And with Father Dave and Father Hans and all of the Holy Trinity community, I would like to invite you, if you feel comfortable, to come and return to Mass and celebrate with us. We're doing all that we can to keep you safe and comfortable in your time here celebrating this most holy sacrifice of the Eucharist, the source and summit of our faith.